Rob way. This week we're gonna take a look at how I did this big portrait of Evolution. Uh, members including Randy Orton, Dave Batista, and Triple H. Uh, it's uh, largely done with liquid acrylic. Uh, what I'll do is I'll uh, use my water brush or just drop a little water in for the area where I'm wanting that certain color to be. And then I'll drop it in and then move it around a little bit with the brush. Uh, still kind of a traditional watercolor approach with uh, layering of colors, although I did limit the palette on this to mostly warm and earth tone type colors. Uh, so you know, more of a flesh tone with some red on it and then a little bit of magenta for uh, you know, a little more dark area on there before I come in with the ink to properly define everything. I uh, love this stable, I think, of all three of them, and also when they were with Ric Flair in their prior incarnation, uh, were just very dominant and very entertaining to watch. Uh, the story of it being, you know, Triple H as the guy, uh, Ric Flair before, and then bringing up these two newer guys, Randy Orton and Batista, you can see how well it did with both Orton and Batista becoming main eventers on their own. And now with all three of them being dominant main eventers, uh, just totally entertaining. And their match uh, against the Shield at Extreme Rules was incredible. Uh, so you can see uh, bringing the ink in to properly define everything. And then I'll do a little bit with water and just dropping ink and color in to let it do its thing. And there's the finished piece, not bad. guys got three new original signed paintings up at auction.wwe.com first we have Titus O'Neil that's spelled T-I-T-U-S and even though he came up short in his WLC match we've got the all-new Hornswoggle it's a big signature and even before bidding has come to a close this is easily going to be the most popular piece we've had it's the Divas Champion page XOXO and up at shop.wwe.com, we have posters of The Ultimate Warrior and Hulk Hogan. More coming soon. And if you're gonna be in Kansas City this weekend, I will be at Spectrum Fantastic Art Live. That's at Bartle Hall. I'll be there Friday through Sunday. Saturday and Sunday, I'll be doing live art, uh, doing one of my new Champions Collection pieces of The Stinger. See you there.